Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Grunt and today I'm going to show you guys how to base all custom weapons on your 5M server. This works for QP and EXE because they're weapon packs so whatever inventory you're using it will work regardless. You know what I'm saying? As long as you install it properly you should be good. So if you guys are watching this video make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. But anyways let's get started. So today I'm going to installing the Cairo weapon pack B6. And it basically gives you all the information you need. It gives you the SQL, the install files with all the information, which is pretty nice. And uh, if you're using SQL, you don't even have to install this if you're using OX inventory. So you don't even have to worry about that. All you got to do is worrying about uh, installing the weapon pack into the server, which I already did. Okay. And then all you got to do is basically you got to need this too. And that's pretty much it easy as that watch so since i'm using ox inventory we're gonna be open up uh my ox inventory in my server so we can see here i have my inventory and whatever inventory you're using just make sure you open up your inventory folder and then uh if it's different compared to mine um if you're using ox inventory all you got to do is pretty much go to your data and then look for uh weapons weapon lures if you have a custom inventory like a different kind of inventory just make sure to look for the weapon lures okay it's pretty pretty simple uh, then we're gonna go install files and then since we're using OX inventory uh, we're gonna be using the installation this is easy guys okay so you, you don't have to worry about this don't worry about that so we, the thing that you need to worry about is pretty much installing the weapon item so we're gonna go uh, copy the whole thing Okay, pretty easy, right? And then all you gotta do is pretty much, uh, you could start off from going from the top, you know, and then press, uh, just fix it up a little bit and press uh, paste it. So it should look like that. You know what I'm saying? Just like that. And then let's go for the next one. Uh, this is for the weapon lures again. This is for the, I guess, the accessories if you wanna put like flashlight and stuff like that. And the attachments you know so we're gonna keep going keep going until we hit the last mark okay it's so easy guys you know what i'm saying we just gotta scroll down where we see the attachments so right here you can see the attachments the components right here and then all we gotta do is pretty much put it on the first one right here like the same as we did on the weapon just blow, make sure just fix it up the layout you know don't put it too crazy but you know you paste it you see everything looks good like that okay and then we're gonna move on to the next step uh this i believe this is the ammo or actually the drums too so you could put those on the bottom uh with the ammo so we're gonna scroll down till we find uh, the ammo and then we could put this here we could literally put this uh you know how we copied this too so uh which one is it right here so we're gonna put it on top of this one so we press enter boom just like that okay pretty simple you know you just gotta follow the layout you know what i'm saying like this is uh, another item right and then there's another comma another item and there's a comma and there's another item so this is where we put our attachments for the drums and then the lastly part guys uh we're gonna scroll down we're gonna put the weapon ammo so whatever ammo needs since we already have the rest of the ammo that works on these we just gotta add the the 10 millimeter on because i believe the structure in here we don't have the 10 mil we only got the 9 mil so then what well, yeah what i do is just put it next to this one so you see a comma you press enter give a little bit of space just to make fix the layout to look very professional like this and then just you know like that just to make it look organized professional that's it and then you save it okay and now we already did the the hard part okay and all you got to do is save it and close it and then you don't have to worry about this no more all you got to do is worrying about setting up the images so we're going to go back to your inventory and locate the folder that it says images so the ox inventory uses the web then images all you got to do is pretty much drag all of these into this into your ox inventory resources and then that's it guys that's pretty it and all we got to do is do a server restart 
So, we're on here, and then we're going to restart this. Once the server restarts, you're going to see that everything works fine. And then on my next episode, guys, I'll show you guys how to basically uh, put them in the gun store or any other custom scripts like in a black market. I'll show you guys how to do that. So um, I'm just going to show you guys right now that it works or show you guys prove that it really works and it's fully installed. So we could go right here and we could look for uh, Garo. You can see it's already running the resources for it. So we're going to load into the server right now. Okay, I gotta mute the song because I don't want to get copyrighted. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna load in here for a couple seconds here. I'm actually building this server, guys. You know, it's called WinCDRP. But uh, yeah. But if you guys got any questions, feel free to comment below, guys. Um, you know what I'm saying? If you guys got any questions, I'm here to assist you, you know. And um, okay, so... Let's spawn a weapon. So it makes it easier now since we already got the the spawn code. There's a lot of people that don't put the spawn codes, but this dude did a great job and provide the proper information that we need. So let's try this one. Let's try this this tech, right? Let me go to live console. Give item one, boom, bam. Let's see if it works. See? I got this bad boy. Damn, that's actually a nice gun, I gotta lie. But yeah, this is, you know, it works fine. Uh, I'll show you what kind of ammo it shows. So I believe this one, this one probably takes uh, ammo. I believe it's not a nine millimeter. So you could also find information in here and look for the spawn code that we spawned. So it's weapon. what did we put it on so it's called sub 22 so look for sub so I use nine meter so we could do this too oh shit so we go back to the console give yourself some ammo boom and then we got ammo too let's reload this you see everything works fine Pretty nice, I like it. But yeah, this is how you install custom weapons on your server. Um, if you guys are watching this video, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. If you guys want more uh, script installations or tutorial how to basically uh, basically set up your server and like install scripts, fix stuff, you know what I'm saying? Uh, hit that like button and subscribe if you're new to my channel. And I'll see you guys next time. That was nasty.